Look, you want to sit for the haul? You want to come for the haul? Charlie is here. Okay, he's just gonna sniff things with his little tail. So, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. Holy crap, you guys are sliding. I'm so sorry. Okay, welcome back to my channel. Hey, what are you doing? Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be, no. Yeah, he likes Kleenexes. Come on, just lay down. It's going to be kind of controversial. Like that. Sorry, you guys. Come on, keep moving. Welcome back to my channel and today's video obviously by the title is going to be <laughs> um, kind of controversial. I'm going to be doing a mini Sheen haul. Now Sheen has, we all know what it is, it's not good. It's not good for the environment, um, but I just wanted to pick up some simple summer pieces and Sheen is where I decided to pick them up. So, um, majority of my wardrobe is honestly thrifted, so I just, I'm not going to try to justify my purchase, but like I know Sheen isn't good, but here I am with a couple pieces. So let's just get right into the video. Make sure you're subscribed. I do a lot more thrifting and makeup videos on my channel. First item I picked up was this daisy pleated skirt and I love a good maxi midi skirt. Excuse this little bean bop back here, but he's just gonna be there. So I picked up this little floral skirt, which I love a good maxi skirt. This one kind of sits in the midi section. Um, so like just above my calves, which I love and it is a bit see-through so i'm gonna have to get like a slip skirt kind of situation to put under this so it doesn't um obviously be see-through but again i love the daisy print and also when you are shopping at sheen make sure you look at the size chart because my sizes are all over the place when it comes to shopping with them another reason why i don't shop with them another item here i got was this skirt which i really like it i love the pattern but it's just not practical there's a slit that if i wanted to wear it i'd probably have to like sew it up and also it has like these ruffles again it's really cute i really like it but i just thought it was something completely different so yeah and it's also paper thin <laughs> like this is not ideal for anything um it's super paper thin so that's that this next item i got was this again it didn't look sheer it's sheer um i'm not really sure how the sleeves are working here or the straps but this reminds me of like very euphoria vibe-esque so it's just like this wavy blue kind of tank top again i think it'd be good for like a cover-up for like the beach because this is just not practical but again it's cute and it's trendy. Oh, this skirt I'm really excited about. I really like this. It's just like this rustic color, which I love a rustic color anything. And it has a little bit of a like a zip, not a zip. I mean, there is a zipper on the side. And then it has like this little slip here, which I think with like little tights or something would be really cute. Again, um, it's very thin. Like the material isn't heavy like you would think, because obviously it's not like real corduroy. But um, again, I just really like the color and it really matches um, this little tank top. Hold on. I, this isn't it really matches this tank top here which i think is really cute and really like 70s vibe which i love the 70s fashion and uh oh yeah so the skirts i got in smalls i believe or extra small and the top i got in a small this bad boy i got in a small also and it's just really cute um nothing else i really like the print of it like i said it just reminds me of a couch you know i just really like it again a little v-neck kind of situation i feel like you could wear this with like a long sleeve underneath and it would like look really cute like high waisted jeans or something like that or just on its own but again really cute the next item again i don't know why i buy these things i think i was going to do like a trending video but here we are we're probably not going to do that um i got this in a small this is just like a dainty little tie up shirt with like ruffly sleeves which again very euphoria um cassie is that her name i think her name is cassie the other one was maddie this is definitely cassie again a little like tie bow thing really cute and just like a basic top you could throw on with anything i have two items left um this item here i wanted to find just a black skirt i just want to find a black skirt that is the perfect length, the perfect fit, not see-through, not too thick, and just no slit. Like, I'm not asking for too much, but, like, this one doesn't check any of those boxes. It's definitely see-through. Probably use it as, like, a beach cover-up, but 
Again, it's cute, but it's just a little see-through. The next item I picked up was this top, and it just gives me, like, tennis vibes. Like, drop my kid off, going to tennis club, and just, like, a basic little v-neck with, like, the collar. Again, very 70s, very retro, and I love that kind of vibe. So, again, really cute. This one I got in a size small. It fits perfect. It's great. I don't recommend shopping on Sheen, but sometimes if you just want, like, some basic pieces that you can't really find anywhere besides that, and you don't want to spend, like, $40,000, on it maybe shop on Shein but like I also don't recommend it because it's not good <laughs> it's just not a good company to shop but I did it so here we are um but yeah if you guys like this video make sure you're subscribed I put out videos every Monday and Thursday at 9 a.m eastern so yeah um let me know where you're shopping um because I'm, I want to try like different shops because I just keep shopping at Valley Village and thrift stores and Plato's Closet so like I said like comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video thanks for watching